burnout, overwhelm, stressed. I hear these words too often from students while getting ready to take the FE exam. And in today's video, we're going to look at signs and causes that are stopping you from taking your FE. Preparing for the FE is a journey, and sometimes you're going to find yourself taking on too much and becoming overwhelmed, which often leads to stalling your studies or even worse, failing your FE exam. So let's first take a look at what it might feel like experiencing burnout and overwhelm. Here are some signs to look for. Procrastinating, unable to concentrate, irritable, trouble starting, feeling guilty or anger, or physical symptoms like unexplained headaches or stomach aches. If any of these sound like what you're going through right now, then it's time to figure out what might be making it worse. A couple weeks ago, I interviewed Mehul, and when he felt his FE exam on his third attempt, he stopped and asked himself the hard question, what am I doing wrong? And he analyzed everything in his life that was stopping him from passing his FE. And by doing that, he was able to figure out what he needed to do to pass his FE. So let's figure out why you might be feeling overwhelmed. And on the next video, I'm going to share with you guys action items that will help you stop feeling overwhelmed so that you can focus on learning and pass your FE faster. After working with hundreds of students, I started to notice that the majority of students feel overwhelmed because of five things. The first thing we have is study material. You might have study material that is leaving you feeling stuck. If you're always studying and you're not progressing or learning, that will definitely leave you feeling overwhelmed. The other thing that I see a lot of students do is that they have a lot of study material that they wanna cover, which also leaves them feeling overwhelmed because it's hard it's almost impossible to study all the material that's out there the second thing we have is higher expectations so a lot of students feel like they have to study 30 to 40 hours a week to be prepared for the fe but that's a lot of hours to commit to especially if you are working full-time and have a family so then because you can't put that many hours a week you get frustrated and you feel like you're never putting enough hours and so you never end up celebrating the small successes and then you end up feeling overwhelmed. The other thing is you might want to get it done quick. But the more you rush the process, the longer it will take you to pass your FE. So you have to remind yourself, this is not a sprint, this is a marathon. Number three, a lot of commitments. You have committed yourself to a lot of activities, but there isn't enough time to do all of them. You don't like to say no either because you feel bad, so you find yourself committed to all these things, leaving you no time or energy to study for the FE. This will leave you feeling burnout and overwhelmed. Number four, not having a balance. You're not getting enough sleep, you're not exercising, and you're not covering out time to recharge. If all you do is work and study and not getting enough sleep or exercise, you will always feel overwhelmed. And the last thing we have is number five, which is failed before. If you have failed the FE exam before and you are afraid to fail it again, you are going to feel overwhelmed, especially if you have to pass your FE exam to either keep your job or get a new job. Before we meet next week, if you have failed the FE exam before, what I want you to do is stop and ask yourself, what am I doing wrong? Just like Mahul did and just be honest with yourself. Maybe you're not studying enough or maybe you are committed to a lot of activities or maybe you're not using the right material. And next week when we meet, we'll discuss the things you can do to feel less overwhelmed and ready to pass your FE. Because remember, repeated mistakes lead to failure. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you are currently studying for your FE exam and you're feeling stuck and overwhelmed with the material that you have, make sure to check out our courses where we simplify the concepts, provide step-by-step -step solutions to over a thousand problems and cover the exact material that you need to pass your FE exam. All our courses are lifetime access so that you can take the time to study at your own pace and pass faster with the engineer method. Before we go, make sure to check out Mahul's interview where he shares his story and how he passed his FE exam on his fourth attempt. Now, thank you guys for watching. I hope you have a great week and I will see you on the next video. A la prochaine. Oh yeah, everybody now.